Hi, I'm Liz from Caravan Guard Insurance. Cleaning your motorhome roof can be a difficult task, but it's important to keep on top of black streaks and also if you have a solar panel fitted, it's important to keep it clean to maximise the charge to your motorhome's leisure battery. It's also an opportunity to check the roof and make sure that everything's in order and there's no damage. We're here at Richard Baldwin Motorhomes where we're going to clean the roof of this very dirty motorhome. But before we start, let's have a look at some of the equipment that we're going to use. So to clean a motorhome roof, you only need a few pieces of equipment and these include a long handled brush, preferably one with a hose attachment, a squeegee for drying, some microfiber cloths and sponge, a water source such as a hose pipe or a pump sprayer, a clean bucket, some shampoo and polish, an appropriate ladder, and for tricky areas, a clean paintbrush. Before we make a start, let's discuss ladders. Make sure you use a ladder that is the correct height for the job. Also, inspect the ladder before use and follow label instructions. Set ladders on a stable, level ground, and always maintain three points of contact. That means two hands and one foot, or two feet and one hand on the ladder at any one time. And finally, have some help to pass equipment and steady the ladder for you. It's vitally important that you never stand on the ladder's top step. In a lot of cases, it isn't a step, it's just part of the hinge mechanism. As we're at a dealership today, we're using this sturdy lockable platform. This allows good access and a platform to walk around. As these lock in place, they do not require extra footing from a second person. Before starting to clean the roof, park the motorhome uphill to encourage water runoff. If you're on level ground, use some levelling ramps to raise the front of the motorhome. On this occasion, we are parked slightly uphill to encourage water runoff the back of the motorhome. If you have a hose pipe, don't get too close to any of the vents or roof lights, but use the spray to disperse any debris off the roof. If you're using a pump sprayer, just moisten the roof as best you can. Dilute some shampoo in a bucket and moisten a microfiber cloth or sponge, then pop inside the motorhome and raise any TV antennas and open the roof lights. Wipe around the edge of the roof lights with a sponge or microfiber cloth. Once clean, close them up again and nip outside to begin cleaning the roof. Using the long handled brush, dip it into the shampoo solution and divide the roof into six equal parts. For example, the front left, the front side and the left back. Then focus on each segment. Start by cleaning around the roof lights that we've already cleaned. Occasionally dip the brush into the shampoo as you continue to clean the dirt from the roof. Brush around any vents and fixings, but please be gentle. You may not be able to get too close to under those items, and in that case use a microfiber cloth or sponge to get in and under the items. For more tricky areas we are using a clean household paintbrush with some silky cream cleaner. Areas such as gutters and TV antennas can really benefit from some intensive cleaning. So work this product in well and remove any dirt or algae from the moulding. Wash down and wipe clean. At this point it's worth discussing the shapes and layouts of motorhome roofs. For camper vans and some smaller coach built motorhomes, the roof can be quite flat and easy to access. However, for overcab sleeping layouts, the task of cleaning this can be quite tricky. We suggest using the long handled brush with a hose pipe attachment that has a constant stream of flushing water through the brush head. Use this to wash as much as you can. You may need to reposition the ladder in a couple of places and even stand on the floor, but try not to stretch or lean over the motorhome as this can be quite unsafe. Once the entire roof has been cleaned, wash down once more and then carry on drying the roof. To dry the roof you can use a squeegee and use this to soak up as much water as you can and then wring it out to remove the excess. For items such as solar panels, it's important to keep this as clean as you can. This will maximise the charge that the solar panel can put into the leisure battery whilst in storage. If you are cleaning the roof before winter storage, you might want to consider an overwinterizing product like this one, or use a good polish to minimise algae or moss buildup. And there we have it, a nice clean motorhome roof, and I'm sure you'll agree it's a vast improvement. So there you go, there's our top tips to getting your motorhome roof nice and clean. The downside is you'll now have to clean the motorhome sides, as we're doing here. 
We'd like to say a big thank you to Richard Baldwin Motorhomes for allowing us to clean this very dirty roof. For more hints and tips, why not head on over to the Caravan Guard website? Thanks for watching.